Ooh, I think this might all be jewelry. This iPhone box. Oh, an iPhone. Oh. Hey. She's like, listen, there was a small, there was a safe in there. We are back outside of our $480 absolutely loaded 10 by 10 abandoned storage unit where we have found cash, safes, designer purses, and all kinds of big money items. Let's open it up and see what else we can find in there. We ended the last part of this unit with $4,430, so let's start there. Let's start going down this center line of boxes here and see what else we can come across. Let's start with this big old, uh, and there's no way this says bathroom. So if you haven't seen the other parts of this video, I swear these people own the salon because the amount of bathroom stuff we found has been incredible. Let's see if that's what this is or not. Just gonna slice and dice it all open. Well, this one is actually all towels and washcloths and things like that, so this is a good box to donate somewhere like an animal shelter, so that's where that'll go. Now let's see what's in the first of these many U-Haul boxes here. I think I see like five or six of these guys in a row. So let's cut the first one of them open and see what they look like they are. What's your guess? You got a guess? Do I know? All right, I don't. fine, be like that. Sorry, you asked if I did. I don't know, what you're <laughs> supposed don't. to say, yeah. All right, let's see, let's see, all right. Definitely looks random, that's what I like to see. I like the randomness. T-shirt, this looks like a digital frame. You think that's what's in there? Seven inch digital photo frame. Let's open this up. Oh yeah, that's actually never been used before. More brand new stuff. Nice. Gotta love it, gotta love it. Is this the box that's gonna have the safe with the money in it, you think? Maybe. Let's see an Air Jordan box down there. You didn't see me knock that open yet. We didn't see what's in there. There's two shoe boxes in there. This is... 2016. Where'd the knife go? This is taped again. Where did my knife go? Did it vanish? Did it vanish? It did a Houdini on me? Okay, let's see what this one just says 2016. Like, that's so uninformative. Um, we got one of these John Hershey kisses. That's a weird memory I remember getting these Valentine's Day and stuff. It looks like a bunch of wrapped up things, so we'll open up a few to see what they are. That is just more candy. Why did they save? So much candy. What was the point? Are you planning on you coming back to eat it? That's a gummy bear. Okay, I'm gonna open one more. If it's some type of candy, I'm done with this. We'll go back into the big box. Nope. That is a little pepper, oh, some salt shakers. Well, that's kind of cool. So some glass figurines in there. See what I see in here? Some CDs. And then we got an Air Force box and a Nike box, so that seems interesting. Let's look in the Christmas cookie tin thing first and see what's in there. A 49ers lanyard, gross 49ers. A bunch of baggies and then rubber bands, empty pill bottle, shoelaces, shoelaces galore. I see Gary from SpongeBob, a Gary lanyard, and a bunch of laptop chargers, but that's all that seems to be in there. Which one should I go for? First, Nike. Nike. Well, they're both Nike, but I know what you mean. Let's go for this guy here. It. Oh, it's. Oh. CDs. The all the ultimate, the cool one. This was the cool kids in elementary school. When you have the crown sharpener in your box, you know you were the cool stuff. Let's see if this has anything in it other than CDs. Anything? Oh, that side has nothing in it. Let's open up the other zipper really quick. Come on, give me something cool. That side has nothing. All right, fair enough. So are these just music CDs. Uh, that guy, uh, these ones, so yeah, just music in there. I mean, all the shoe boxes. There's actually three total shoe boxes in here. Let's open up this other Nike one first. And that one is all music CDs. And what about the Air Force box? Open up. I can tell you I look it in there. I don't have to rip it. This one is also all music. Got the next one of those U-Haul boxes, and let's cut this one open and see what we have. No more CDs. I mean, CDs are money, so I won't complain, but you know, I like to mix it up and see different things, so I kind of want something different. Let's see what we got. You have a guess this time around? Um, I was hoping for more random stuff. Maybe a jewelry box in here? Uh, well, those are the CDs. These are the DVDs. Like an absolute horde of them. Let's just open a couple and see if we got them in there. Yeah, Ghosts on the Loose. Uh, Black Nativity, it's in there. Waist Deep, that's in there. This one right here is brand new. And this box is, I mean, pretty tall and it goes all the way to the bottom with 
three rows across, so I'd say probably at least 100 DVDs in that one, so can't complain. Let's mix it up and go with the little Huggies box right here. Let's see what's in this one. Okay, I see wallets, that's a good sign. Yeah, but is there anything inside of them? Not in that one right there. What about this black one? Is this a wallet or a phone case? It looks like it could be both, but nothing inside of it either which way. I uh, don't know what that is. Yes, paper clips, just what I needed. And pencils. That looks fun, we'll see that in a second. Oh yes, candy. I never found so much candy in a single storage unit before. What does this say? Somebody's name, born on May, May 28th, 1978. That's an old sticky note. Uh, what else is in here? Anything? Bathroom junk and pills. Lovely. Let's see. These cards? Do we have cards? Let's see. Sticky notes, coupons, and ooh, somebody's password for some something. I don't know what it's for, but it's going in the pocket just in case we find a laptop. Let's see. This just nothing. All right. Let's slide it aside. Is this looks like a jewelry box, and I'm gonna hope that's what that is. Let's see. Ooh, I think this might all be jewelry, doesn't it? That's what it, that's what it looks <laughs> what, like. What it looks like. I just stuttered so bad. <laughs> no sleep. Ooh, what's... Let's see. These bracelets. That has nothing in it, dang it. Let's see. Another bracelet. I just dropped the watch. That's pretty. I was going to say that's pretty pretty, but it's pretty. <laughs> Let's see what's in the little orange one. Whoa. Yay. Paper clips. What about the heart? The heart's gotta be where the real jewelry is, right? Ooh, yeah, it is, actually. Look at that, let's see what we got. This looks like it definitely could potentially be gold. It looks like the right color. Made in Korea, American show class. It says on it, it says something on it. It says Korea on one side, and it says something K, but I can't read what that is yet. So I'm gonna assume that's some kind of gold. Hopefully a higher carrot. Look at this little ringy ring. I was about to say little ringy. Little ring with a B on it. It just, it has a C that's underlined in there. I don't really know what that means, but that's pretty much it. The rest looks like some costume jewelry type stuff. What about this one here? That bag has nothing in it. The big one? What's, what's it got? Oh, some watches. Let's see what they are. A couple of watches and Ashley right there. And that one doesn't have a brand in it, but it still looks very nice. We'll put that over here. This guy, ooh, I like the sound of that right there. Let's see what's inside there. Whoa, that looks like a big old piece of gold. If that can be real. Come on, give me the good marking. 14K, I swear that's 14K. Look at the size of that. If that's real, that is a lot of money. You think you can focus on a 14K? Maybe. I seriously doubt it. We're gonna <laughs> test this camera's capabilities. Look at my finger, look at my finger. Look at my finger. Oh, Ooh, too, too close. close. There we go. Can you see 14K? Yep. Boom, if that's real gold, that's that's a good, good chunk of this unit back right there. What else is in this box right here? Are these all gold necklaces? Let's see if this one has a marking on it right here. Uh, I don't see it because it's tangled up really badly right here. So I'm not gonna be able to get it apart, but I'm gonna put the one that's marked 14K in my pocket for now so we can look at it in a little bit. A lighter, does it work? It actually does. That's unusual. There's another watch. Nice face on that one. Piece of something that looks silver. And another plastic bead necklace. Cross your fingers for us, guys. That gold is real. This clear toe was actually right under that one with the jewelry we went in. So let's hope for more goodness. And by goodness, I don't mean 10-year-old rotting chocolate. But, you know, that's what it looks like right there. That looks like bathroom crap. But we'll dump it out. Uh, the rest of this stuff... Pills and pads. There's an M&M &M mug. Yeah, the rest of it's I, pads. Hold on. There's something yeah. gold down there. Is there? Yeah. Oh, I saw a car. Ooh, it looks like to, a royal bag. I have to dump it out. Ew. Let's see what's in there. Come on. I'm getting pills all over my truck. Ooh, a nice knife. Let's keep going. Let's keep it all out. Uh, yeah, there looks to be a lot in there. A lot of junk too, but looks like a lot of good stuff. What's in the gold bag? Nothing in the Crown Royal bag. A couple cards here. Uh, that's a Cash App card and a Sheets card, so nothing for us. Garbage. Uh, there's a little penny, a 1982 penny. This is what I'm interested in right here. I see a ring in there. It looks like a big old ring to be honest with you. Let's 
see. Let's pour it out. Come out, come out. All of you come out. What's the pendant say? An Avon breast cancer pendant. I'm so, oh, look, it's golden with the pink diamonds in it to represent breast cancer. Now, look at this big old ring here. It looks silver with a nice big blue gem in it. Have you ever played Spyro? Doesn't it look like the blue gem from Spyro? Yeah. Identical. It says PK in there. PK? All right. I guess they're PKing people. <laughs> There, ooh, that says 14 carat on it right there. Can you see that pendant? Yep. That's super nice. I doubt you can focus on that. That's a really small 14K. Let's test these camera's capabilities. Can you see that 14K? Mm. All the way on the left side. Uh, too far. Kinda. I think you can kind of see it. That says 14K, so that's going in the pocket too. What about these earrings and things? I don't see anything on these but we'll check it out for sure later uh let's see paperwork and personal stuff junk i don't want your gun Ooh, there's a gold necklace this one looks really yellow though so i feel like it's not gonna be anything and it's 14 k g g f what does g f mean um, no idea. i'm just gonna put, put it in my pocket i'll just pretend like i know couple of earrings, candy canes. Look at this nice leaf necklace here. Uh, get off candy cane, off, off, off. I like talking to inanimate objects, don't ask me why. This one just says Napier on it. That's a brand, I remember we found it before, like a nice brand of costume jewelry, so it's not gonna be gold, but it still might have a little value. Uh, medical card, random pills. Uh, well, I mean, if that's how you feel, that's how you feel. <laughs> not gonna read that. Look at the nice knife. Let's see. We might actually be using this to cut open the rest of the boxes instead of our broken one. Yeah. I think I'll hold on to it. Well, there's another ring over here I missed, I think. Yeah, earring. there is an earring. Dang it. Other than that, a bunch of pills. Does anyone recognize a little white pill with 220 written on it? I'm kind of curious what it is. If you know, let us know in the comments. But the rest of it, yeah, I think it's just crap. Let me quickly address the title of this video. So we were driving, right? We get a call, didn't know who it was, picked it up, and then quickly realized after they introduced herself that it was actually the manager of one of the storage facilities. Not the current unit we're going through, but the very big one we got at the beginning of the year that had the safe full of money that the owner claimed, oh, my passports and credit cards were in the safe, which is not true. You saw the video. You saw what was really in the safe. She called the manager. He called us and just, just listen to this conversation. And she took all that stuff and she said, do you know the people that won the unit? And I said, no, but I do have their, I'm not allowed to give them your information. But right. she's like, listen, there was a small, there was a safe in there that had my credit cards and my passports. Do you know if they found that? And I said, I don't know. Did you guys happen to see that? No, not at all. No? No. Okay. I told her, I said, I'll just reach out to her. I said, they're, 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 they're very, um, you know, you guys do this all the time. I don't know if you do it for a living. I said, but they're good people when it comes to stores, treasures, and making sure they leave personal items, you know, because yeah. they do this for a living or a lot. So I explained to her, you know, you guys are very nice. And I've dealt with you guys at least twice, about yeah. three times now in the last few years. So, all right. Yeah, she's like, well, there was a small safe, had my passports in there and my credit cards. And I was like, yeah, I'll reach out. So, all right, I'll let her know you didn't find it. Okay. And if you do, let me know. Okay, thank you. Thanks, Amber. Yep. As you saw in the video, none of what she said was true. They just wanted that safe back because it had all the cash in it. They are liars, which is why we said we didn't have it because, well, they said a safe with the passport and credit cards. We didn't find a safe with the passport and credit cards, did we? So technically, we're not lying, but what a crazy story. Let's get back to the unit. Really big box. I had to cut this open, and it's full with a bunch of randomness. So what I had to do in the last video, I had to dump it out, kind of. I'm not going to completely just dump this one all over the road, but I'm going to take it all out pretty much <laughs> <laughs> i mean pretty much i just don't want to break anything just in case because i see this on the top and i don't know what else is down there like this so this is like a little pot with the top it says not for food so whatever you want to use it for it's pretty cool um, looks old i guess all right why are you saying um because it, it low-key looks like an urn okay <laughs> i kind of think it's an urn <laughs> but okay well whatever uh we have a throw we have a bunch of wires right here which I'm just gonna toss to the side because they keep continuing and there's a lot of them. Get out. Okay. Every unit. So then we have a little pour to close also. Some kitchen plasticware. And then 
thank you motorcycle car or whatever that is. And then we have some DVDs. Let's see if any of them are in here. We have Gamer. Yeah. We have this one, but still, it is in there. We have a lot of DVDs like here on the top. All right. I mean, pretty pretty good stack of them here. So I'm gonna have to take these out to see what's under them because there's a lot of stuff under here. Man, I wonder what could be under there. It's it, so random right here. That's what I like to hear. Okay, um, I don't even know where to start. So we have cube organizer, some belts, this plastic thing, index cards. Well. Yeah. This glass thing with a picture snow globe in there. Don't want to break that. A vase. Don't care. Uh. There's a couple of big things right here. Let's see if I can get them out. A brace. What is, uh, it looks like a like a boxing shoe. It looks it looks like <laughs> an, like you feel it. it's so hard right here. Yeah. That's why I thought it was a brace, but it looks like an old one. Like is this how they used to make like ankle brace? What's that on the bottom? It has a name on it. Oh uh, okay. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get this out. Uh, what is this? What is that? Speaker. Is it? Okay. Yeah. Yep, speaker. Oh, it was right. like this. I thought this was the like the legs. Oh. But I don't know. It looks like it still is. Yeah. So down here, hard for you to see. Um, we got some more DVDs, some brush toothbrush. I thought those are cards at first. <laughs> no, another brace thing. All right. I don't know. I don't know what exactly what that is. A little stack of 45s. Oh, all right. Here. What do we have? You got the love I need. You wouldn't know these songs. No, I don't know that song. Oh. <laughs> that one. That one. That one. And one more. That one. So if you guys know those songs and whatnot, you kind of know what genre. Based on the CDs, I would say like uh, Motown, R&B type music in this unit. Brand new Washington Nationals thing. More DVDs, a dead cricket. At least you said cricket. Ooh. Ooh, a jewelry box. I just saw that too. Oh, I see something else cool down there too. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Oh, I think I see something in there. Wow. Ooh. It's like old things. Quite a few rings, it looks right like. Here. All right, what is it, three? It Four? Like something to top too. Okay. Yeah, nothing in there but this little thing. All right. That little thing has a stone in it. And on the back, it does say something. So, hold on a second. I see Sterling. Okay. That's all I see, though, is just the word Sterling on that one. That's all we need. This one look, looks like a belt. Yeah, that's cool. Um, This one is pretty cracked in the middle, and I don't see any markings. This one says 925. Alright. Right there. This one. Gold. I don't see any markings on that one. Dang it, it looked gold. And then this little one. Silver. Looks like the end of a spoon. I don't see any markings in that one either. I'm willing to bet that one's sterling. But at least it was a little little ring box with some jewelry in it. Yeah. Something else that I see that is cool is this. Ooh, is that a dagger? This looks familiar, doesn't it? Didn't we have something like that? I feel like, yeah, I feel like we Maybe found we got one it like that. Maybe got a yard that. sale or something. But it looks cool. Ooh. Check that out. Was it like a dagger? Yeah, that's what I'd say. Is that's that a nice sheath? blade. Yeah, it's nice. Set that right Ooh, here. what a beautiful weapon. <laughs> Let's see what else we can find down here. You got the cool box. Yeah, it's definitely the random cool box, yes. I mean, I'm happy um, with gold, but you got weapons. Yep, staples. Handmade thing. What is this? Collect Hallmark collector's pen. All right, that's cool. Then we have a first aid kit. We have a couple more DVDs, and then there's one more big thing right here. Kind of don't want to take it out though. Looks like the other speaker. Well, it has um like an actual net netting on it. Yeah. The other one didn't. Okay. It's just another speaker. Let me see if it says anything on the back. Subwoofer. LG speaker system. The 45s, more DVDs. And, oh, what's this? Ooh, you got the hidden bag. That is all 45s. Really? Like, <laughs> look at this. 
Wow. It's like this, all, all this is 45s. That's a big stack right there. Yeah, I don't want to take it out of the bag because it's all nice and concealed for me. Sweet. Second bag, I got to just dump out. Well, <laughs> let's see what good riddance. Yep, my bag. iPhone box. iPhone box. Ooh. Have some weight to it. Uh-oh. <laughs> there it is. We already got the watch. Give me the phone. Aw. Oh. Boo. And nothing in there. I'm sure that if there was actually an iPhone in there, it would be like considerably heavier. So you can kind of tell. But Shh. Don't give away my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> Daisy Mark Jacobs box. So Ooh. is this like a perfume? I, I don't know. Out. Get out. Oh, bag. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's the box is what it is. Well, I guess I can use it. <laughs> uh, 49er thingy. Heal your body, A to Z. Cotton candy, what's in there? Just batteries. Ew. Uh, metrics thing. What is this? Like a scarf. Metro box. What you got? So it's in here. That thing? Ooh, an elite speaker? Elite Metro. How's that weight? Uh, mm, not, not too good. We got a phone box in here. Uh-oh. A Moto G7. Hello, Moto. Hello, Moto. Get out, get out. Nothing. Aww. Dang it. Why is everything itching? This I believe in you. Is a bag full of bags. Yes. A fitness ball box that doesn't definitely doesn't have a fitness ball in there. $100,000 in there. Sounds like it has something in there. Oh, like the pump for it. Aww. A little lunch tray box. What is it here? That's the million. Uh, paperwork. But we have some Apple gift cards again. No way. <laughs> no way. If, it, if we get lucky again, I will literally, for you know, poop on myself. But I was about to say something different. I probably shouldn't. <laughs> and what's kind of funny, Current. Current. <laughs> We've been sponsored by Current. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird. All right, let me just kind of skim through this a little bit. And I will look through it more off camera, but right now, all I see is that Apple gift card. Well, we gotta call that. This bag was laying right there in the corner and I picked it up. Jeebus told me to pick it up and see what was in it. And it looks like a bunch of wallets and or purses and maybe some random stuff at the bottom. Uh, this this one yep. has some receipts in there and some prescription. I don't see like many brands on here. I think the first one was like Marc Jacobs or Steve Madden, but none of the other ones really had a brand. I like the color of this one. It looks like a Tiffany color, kind of. Yeah. Uh, but all of them are pretty much brand new. The zipper doesn't want to go back. The amount of brand new bags in this unit. All right, in here is just a bunch of like medical stuff. Don't really want to sift through it. It's like pills, forks, cream. Mm. There's a flashlight. That's Yeah, regular lovely. flashlight. So in the paperwork, we found a dollar scratch off winner. Yay. So we'll check that. And then we found two Apple gift cards and the receipt for those gift cards, but there's three on the receipt. We found two. Still super cool, definitely have to call them. All right, let's get into this colorful bag. It usually has clothes in it and it feels like soft, but hopefully not. Hey, stuffed Actually, animals. Actually stuffed animals and a baby thingy. Ooh, I see coins. Oh, I see some weird things in there. Hold on a second. Yeah, Coins like and I think things. I saw like a spoon thingy. Let's dump it out. All over the place. Oh. Okay. Chuck E. Cheese token. Hey, We're a kid. Right, we got a kid. couple shoes. A of New Balance. This little. Oh, I thought there was coins in there. It's just a bell on the shoe. <laughs> little sandals. Hat. What's in here? There's more stuff in this little thing. Okay. Looks like it's like the hospital van. Yeah, yeah, hospital van. And this is congratulations and best wishes, um, doctors. I wonder if they're sterling. I don't know. Maybe realistically, this stuff will probably get back to them. So this says WMA Rogers One One Ida Limited. I've never yeah. heard of that. I've heard of like Rogers, like yeah, silver company, but silver plate. All right, let's see what these tokens are. So we have Chuck E. Cheese, Chuck E. Cheese, Chuck E. Cheese, Chuck E. Cheese. Yay! Yay! We have a penny. Which is 2002. No cash value. Like uh, the, what, like a hotel? Arcade. Like a, yeah, okay, okay. Arcade. A Canadian coin, 25 cents. France. Yeah, cool. a France coin. One, it just says one. So I don't know if this is like a dollar. Probably a dollar. A Canadian, also. 
and then another Canadian. And in the bag, we have a few stuffed animals, but I see like a pretty decent pile of Beanie Babies right here. Look at this. Oh, snap. Check beanie that Babies. Out. Hey, oh, Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong. Look at him. Toy sight. <laughs> nice. He's like a little beanie. That's Junior, actually. Is it? Yeah. Oh, with the hat, right? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Mickey Mouse. We have a couple bigger ones on there. Reindeer. Let me see. Let me just see. Pull down here, see if there's any cool ones. Fun Another though. Beanie Baby. Hmm. Another B. A little plush. Oh my gosh, what's the B say on it? Plush Furby. B Smart Buckle Up. Okay, never mind. <laughs> what do uh, you think it said? The old country buffet the restaurant used to have a bee mascot that would give out little bee stuffed animals, and I was like really little. It looked <laughs> like it. Okay. Well, we found look Ronald McDonald bear. Nice. Billy, do they give these out in Happy Meal? Probably once upon a time. And I mean, overall, just like if I reach all the way down here, it's just like these little things. Okay, so we ran into this issue now where we can't reach up there and pull it down, so I'm just gonna have to pull this U-Haul box. See what happens. I'm stepping back. Ready? Run for your life. Well, it definitely went down, all right. Yeah, it did go down. Not as much stuff came down as I hoped, but... A lot of it. Yeah. So we found this Copper Chef box. Looks to have, like, the factory seal things on it still. So let's see if it's actually brand new. That'd Hopefully. be pretty cool. If I can get the box cutter in there to get this tab out, that'd be great. Thank you. No, the tab's like, I ain't going nowhere. No, for real. Put that over there. Come right. on. Come on, let's be brand new, please. Hey. Oh, yeah. All right. I think that's the whole set right there. Now that's a good find. Definitely, definitely a good find. Next tote we have is right here. And it seems to be a lot of random. So I'm gonna have to do the same thing like I did with the other stuff. Just kind of toss it around. Poor so I Barbie. A, I know, poor Barbie's box. She's a little mouse pooped in there too. But yeah. whatever. Uh, this one is a purse that has a lot of stuff in it. So what's this? A million. How does this open? Oh, so maybe <laughs> lipstick or something? Yeah. I don't know. We have a lot of paperwork here. Paperwork. Ooh, I'm not gonna Crayola. lie. This bot, this tote's awfully cr close to, what? you know, between my legs and there's mouse poop <laughs> in it. I'm not feeling comfortable. Well, we'll see. <laughs> But we have a 64 pack of Crayola Crowns. Nice, with right. the sharpener, built-in sharpener that on the back. That was the box, man, that's, that was the box. Yep, that's the box. This is cinnamon Ew, graham crackers. Yeah, those have been eaten. Um, man, mice initiated ate good. I know, they did. So overall, uh, what I'm seeing in here is like some paperwork, bag of medicine. Uh, let's see if there's anything in here. If not, there's not much else. And we'll check for, you know, little things off camera. And then we have a whole stack of plastic plates, which would be, that was a spider that scared me. <laughs> okay. Which would be great to use if it wasn't in this unit. Yeah. Dang it. This, which is black cherry vanilla flavored vodker. 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 <laughs> vodka. That's what the new alcohol is called, huh? I know. Yep. All right. This thing has nothing in it. Simply Vera Wing. So it's a pair of shoes. Oh, I thought it was another bottle. Hmm. There we go. They look like ballet shoes. Yeah, they're not. Uh, yeah, I mean, get you worn five times. Yeah. Now that I'm down here, hey, more. More what? what? This? <laughs> uh, Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey. Imagine if the mice got into all this and they're as <laughs> drunk as can be. Do you think they'd all be dead? I don't know. They drank straight vodka. Green apple. Imported from Holland, just like the other one. Nice. There's, I like those bottles, actually. I mean, I don't drink, but I like the bottles. Uh, what's in here? Looks like we can see right through it. Looks like a bunch of nail polish. That thing. A tail. <laughs> that thing. Uh, where's that black thing? Uh, over there. That... Over here. Come on, give me a good All knife. Right, husky. Oh, you... nice too. What the heck? A t oh, it's oh. like a razor. <laughs> and then this one is a little knife. Two for one deal. Cool. So this tote. It's a little. Hey, what's this purple box? Palm Beach Ooh. jewelry. Uh oh. Hey, right. there's actually stuff some, in it too. Let's go. Yeah, probably like four earrings and a ring. The ring got Let's a marking. See if I can see a marking. If I can get the earring off of it. Come on, gold, go. gold, gold. Uh, I see something in it. I see 10k. Hey, gold ring. Nice. Check that out. 10k. 
That's nice looking, actually. Yes, very. Sweet. All Gotta right. love gold. Gold's yep. basically cash. Gotta love it. All right, what's in here? Besides a bunch of bathroom stuff. What's in this? Uh, More gold. Oh. Paper clips and pins. We have some more. Let's see. Cream. Toothpaste. Will you check something for uh, me? Bathroom. What? In that top corner, there's a little Bible. Make sure there's no money in it. <laughs> Let's see. This will be the one time. The one Bible you get would have cash in it. Yeah. I was no. kind of hoping. But this tote is just all bathroom. I'm not really going to dig much more in there. What is Shoes? this? Ipsy box. They have a lot of like weird brands of shoes I've never heard Lamb of. bag. Oh, maybe it's not shoes. Okay. What nope. the heck is it? It's fashion forward. Ooh. A bunch of makeup. So is this like a like a monthly prescription box or something? Might be. Tula huh? Skin Care. Um, Harmony Mask. They're Soothe and Smooth. That's All a cool right. little box. Probably a subscription box you get online, like I said. Yeah. Is that another uh, knife? This might be the razor I threw back in there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. I thought it was another one. So let's go over here. We have another vodka bottle. We have another tote over here. Come on. Something cool. Something Come cool. Come on, tote. Come on, so there's a dead mouse down there. Is it? <laughs> yeah, right here in the corner. Oh, that's lovely. <sighs> I'm so tired of seeing it. As long as you're sure it's dead. Yes, it is dead. Uh, Partially paperwork. decomposed? Yes. <laughs> lovely. Great. I knew I'd find one. That might be multiple. Lovely. Great. I hate these black things that keep like popping up at me. Yeah. Go away. Go away. All right, what's in here? That, what's this? So bathroom. it's a dove bag, yeah, it's bathroom stuff. I just want to make sure there's no like hidden, you know, compartment with jewelry in there. No way. Nothing in there. This one? What's that jingling? I don't know, it sounds like it could be changed. Uh, maybe just these metal things clinking yeah, together. Probably. Yeah, probably. Nothing in there. And we have another one? Yeah, another bag. Come on, this one's got to be the one. Oh, wow, whoa, whoa, an whoa. iPhone. Hey. Hey. Whoa, is, is that? Hey, it's the Apple Watch charger. Is it really? Yay. Hopefully we that'll go that. to it. <laughs> that, that's what the picture looked like. So hopefully cool. it will go to it. So this app, um, iPhone right here is model number A1349. But I want to say one of the first three. Yeah, I'm sure. But it's actually not cracked, like no. on the back or the front, which is very, very rare to see. Yeah, I used to think iPhone just came cracked. I know. So I'm going to put this <laughs> over here so I can keep that. Yeah, I'm so glad we could charge that now. Yeah, we had that iPhone sitting at home with no charger, hoping we'd find it before we bought it. And there it is. There it is. So this doesn't feel like anything's in there. A lot of stuff in this tote. It is. Including a dead mouse dummy. You gotta love dead mice. Yep. Alright, down here is a Dollar Tree bag. Candy or something. Envelopes. Envelopes. Okay. I mean, we can always use envelopes, but this whole thing right here is candy. More candy. Why do they have so much freaking food and candy? This I is why they have so know. many mice in the unit. 